Now the first step is to use cellular data, connect to your mobile hotspot. So turn on the data on your phone and then turn on hotspot on your phone. And at the bottom right here, you can see the Wi-Fi icon. You can click on it and select your uh, phone network. Connect to your phone network over here. Once you connect it, now you can launch the game and then you can check. If that does not work, you can switch to different network. Like you can try 5 gigahertz, you can you, you can try 2.4 gigahertz, and if you have any other if you have any other network, you can switch to different network, and then you can check. If that does not work, the next step is to turn on or turn off VPN. So if you have a VPN, you can just use VPN, turn it on, and then check. This has worked for many uh, players, so it might work for you. If you are already using VPN. And if it is already on, then you can turn it off and then check. And if you're not using VPN, you can install VPN. You can go to Google, you can install any like popular VPN and then you can check. This has worked for many players, so it might work for you. Now, the next step is to delete, delete the Roblox log files. Now for this, you can just open run box. So type in run in Windows search box and then click on run box. And then over here, type in percentage local app data percentage and then click on OK. Open the Roblox folder and then open the here. You can see the logs. You can make a right click. You can just copy it. You can paste it to the desktop, create a backup and then you can delete this log folder and then you can launch and then check. Still not working. Uh, the next step is to try Roblox app to play the game. So you can go to Roblox website. First of all, uninstall the Roblox. So you can uninstall it. After you uninstall it, if you're using Microsoft Store version or if you're playing in the browser, in that case, you can use Roblox app. Now for this, you can just search in Google and then you can go to Roblox website and then you can download it. Uh, let me, you can just type in Roblox app download in Google search and then you can go to download Roblox and then you can click on download Windows app. Once the download is complete, you can run the exe file and then you can install it and then you can launch Roblox and then you can check and then try to log in. Still not working. Uh, then if in that case, you can use Microsoft Store version. So uninstall the current version and then open Microsoft Store. In the Microsoft Store, you can just search for uh, Roblox over here. And then you can try the Microsoft Store version. So install it and then you can open it, launch it and then check. And if both are not working, you can even try browser version. So you can just try to open uh, Roblox in uh, like browser. Just uh, in the Google search, you can just type in uh, Roblox and then you can go to Roblox website and then you can log in and then you can check. So in the search, you can simply type in Roblox and then you can go to Roblox website and then you can log in and then check. If that does not work, run this command. These commands are provided in the video description. Type in CMD in Windows search box. Make a right click on command prompt app. Click on run as administrator. Make sure that you open command prompt as an administrator. Click on yes to allow. Copy all these commands one by one. Paste it over here. Hit the enter key. Now run the second command. So copy the second command. Paste it over here, hit the enter key, run the third command, paste it, hit the enter key, and then run this command, and then run this command. Once you run everything, run all the commands, then restart. You can be restart is a must. After the system restart, you can log in and then check. Next step is to disable or enable the network adapter. So you can make a right click on the start menu and then go to device manager. And over here, you will see your uh, network adapter. You can just uh, make a right click on your network adapter. First of all, disable device. And then you can enable, your, enable it once again. Enable device. Once it is enabled, now you can launch Roblox and then you can check. If that does not work, start WLAN auto config service. Now for this type in services in Windows search box and then click on services. Now find WLAN auto config 
and then make a double click set it to automatic and then hit apply and if start is highlighted click on start with this selected make a right click and then click on restart and once this is done now you can check you can even switch to ethernet connection so if your computer has a ethernet port and if you have a ethernet cable you can switch to wired connection and then check next step is to try google dns server now for this you can type in control panel in windows search box and then go to network and internet network sharing center and then you can make a you can click on your network and then go to properties over here and over here select so select internet protocol version tcp ipv4 and then once you select it click on properties and over here select the option which says use the following dns server and over here type in 8 8 8 8 and then over here it's uh, 8844 4. so it's 8 8 4 4 and then click on validate up settings upon exit click on ok close it close it close it close it now the last step is to perform network reset now before you perform network reset make sure that you have the wi-fi password now for this uh, you can just open windows settings and then go to network and internet over here and scroll down um, click on advanced network settings over here and then you will see network reset option click on network reset and then click on reset now make sure that you have the wi-fi wi password when you try to log in the computer will restart when you try to log in it will be asking for your password so if you have the password click on yes and then you can uh, restart your computer and then try to connect to your network and then you can check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get rid of error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel